Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of my uh, Feed the Beast Let's Play featuring the Feed the Beast Mind Crack mod pack. Very good stuff here. And uh, as you can see here, we got some villagers over in this area of town. Uh, so yeah, this is uh, basically because all of the villagers that I had before, save for a few, have uh, basically died off for some odd reason or another. Uh, probably either because they wandered into caves or uh, into into the nether or uh, s yeah some odd reason or another so uh, between this episode and the last I uh, decided to go ahead and make me a bunch of doors and then hide them uh, basically underneath these here stairs that I made so yeah there are a good amount of doors here so these guys should at least be populated over in this direction uh, so yeah, good stuff there. And uh, I did do a good bit of hunting here for the uh, old villagers, and I uh, just didn't have much in the way of luck, um, which is much bummers. Uh, I also decided to uh, go ahead and make me a space of my own uh, in this village. And uh, yeah, found out at least Originally, I wanted to take this house up here, but uh, second thought, I was like, eh, probably not going to be enough for me. So what I did was I actually took and uh, down here dug me out some area. So I've got at least a little bit of room here. Good stuff. Uh, now what's going to happen here, I am going to use uh, this room over here as a workstation. I'm going to put any machines that I make in here uh, for like processing of ores and, and uh, other cr like uh, machines that require power or whatnot. Yep, that's what this room is going to be. Um, over here is going to be a research room for Thomcraft stuff. Cool. And over here is going to be storage. And, uh, yeah, this room is probably going to go out that way some. So I'm going to take this wall and, and just push it back a good bit. So I have plenty of space for storage. Awesome stuff. Uh, so, what we've got... Uh, also, what I want, intend on doing is making a uh, second story just down below. Uh, probably just below this room and this one uh, for power generation and storage whatnot. Very good. Uh, now, as for other stuff to do, uh, yeah, the whole room down there is actually in preparation for a quarry. Uh, I actually need to make me a quarry so that I have me a decent amount of uh, materials. Uh, of course, I could do some caving, but eh, caving is not particularly interesting in some cases. Yeah, I do like exploring, but caves, not so much. At least it gets old. So with that, I gotta sleep and be right back. Okay, well here I am back down here. I uh, do want to at least get some things in my uh, Thumbcraft room here complete. So, um, now at least according to the Thumbnomicon, the Nitor here can produce a little bit of heat. So I at least want to experiment a little bit. Uh, so I'll put that thing down there and then put a crucible right on top of it. Okay. Uh, so, with that, hopefully, I will be able to get water boiling in the crucible so I can craft me things. That'll be nice. Okay, so next, beyond that, let's go into our crafting table here. Give me at least a few barrels. Very good. Cool. Now, that should get me started here. Let me see how I want to get this set up then. 
Okay, I believe I have what I want for my basic plan here. Uh, so what I'm going to have here is a, uh, an ender chest right in this corner. And a filter followed by some nice, uh, some nice tubes going up on the top of these barrels. And then it's going to go up and over here and in these barrels. And uh, it's going to snake all the way over here and to another ender chest. Of course, I am going to need to get ender pearls. Which is going to be a little bit of a chore, but uh, yeah, we'll see. Anyway, um, at the end of this, this ender chest is going to go actually to back behind this wall. Uh, and this wall is going to end up being knocked out and... Uh, there's going to be a sorting system with some, some uh, regular chests on uh, this wall. So yes, very nice, good stuff here. I think it'll look decent. Alright, uh, so with that, I have me some ender farming to do, I suppose. Okay, time to test out if our night tour works here for this purpose. Let's see what we got here. And either it's going to be really slow or it's not working. Of course, I expect it to be just a little bit faster from from my previous experience with lava. But hey, that's just that. We'll see here. Yeah, apparently it's not working. Okay, well, no biggie. Ah, uh, we can fix that, no problem. Okay, fix our problem here. I just got me some nether rack, and flint steel will make me fire. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, so that where is my crucible? Thank you. Very good. And back there. Now, let's go ahead and get us our bucket there fire and now what we need to put in there once it starts boiling there we go uh let's see if i recall correctly it was a decent amount of torches i think it was six torches and two charcoal Okay, now we hit it with the wand. Boop! Nitor! Ah, perfect. Okay, so yeah, let's get me some more Nitor. That's basically why I wanted the Crucible at this point, uh, just to get me a little bit more light, because uh, I really don't want torches here. So what I am going to do is actually knock out in this room, because why not? Like right up there. Okay. Knock out the wall there, there. Oh, I got. Let's see, I have marble on me. Yes, I do. Cool. Let's put marble right there. And let's put some night ore there. Okay. Cool, now I can knock these out. Awesome. So, that'll be my lighting solution for down here. Very nice. Okay, now as you can see, I did a little bit of uh, exchanging of light sources here. Now what I would like to do is, is actually cover these things with glass. Uh, so I'll go ahead and do that, see how that looks. And I think think that'll look decent, except for one thing here, which I'm going to fix. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have the resources I need for that just yet, but whatever. Okay, we can fix that later. Okay, so let me go ahead and glass this out, and we shall be good, yeah? Yeah. Oh, hello. I mean iron golem, apparently. So yeah, very good. I apparently have enough villagers to where the iron golem spawned, which is nice. 
Very good. Yes, you are good guys. Awesome. Well, I've been trading a good bit here. Uh, now I need to go ahead and get me a little bit more, and I think this is the guy that I need. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, so let's go ahead and trade for an Eye of Ender here. Very good. That'll be my third Eye of Ender. Uh, very nice. So I'll go ahead and get that, and then do some prep work for some exploring. Okay, back at the enchanting table, I have a couple of pieces of bronze armor that I found while at the uh, the skeleton spawner. Uh, so yeah, very nice. Let's go ahead and put, yeah, 10 levels. 11 levels will be fine there. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I like that. Okay, 13 levels there. Not bad, not bad. Alright. Very good. Ah, uh, so with that, we look good here. Awesome. Awesome stuff. And, uh, this is just about done, so... Wouldn't be surprised if that broke here pretty quick. Uh, beyond that, I'll get me some boots, and we'll see how it goes from there. And I will go ahead and see what I can find. Okay, I figure what better place to start looking for the stronghold than just outside my little outpost here. Ah, uh, so let's go ahead, take our eyes, see where it leads me. Oh, over there. Okay. Cool. So you're gonna come back here, and I'm gonna go ahead and go that way about 200 blocks or so. Okay, 200 blocks later, let's try this again, shall we? And over that way. Very good. Now, eight. I want my eye back. Thank you. Alright, keep going. Okay, now which direction we got? Still in that direction. Alright. Very good. Nope, nope. I want my eye. Come on. Thank you. Okay. Very good. Oh, fun. Yeah, we got big trees here. Ah, uh, so yeah, continuing my search here. What do we got? Over that away. And hopefully my eye is going to come back to me and not go into these trees, but we'll see. Anyway, good stuff. Okay, well, lost one eye. And no big deal. I've got two more. Now, where to? Whoa. Uh, up there? that way. Okay, different direction. Um, yeah, very good. Okay, now where to be? Where we be? Over that way. Okay. Now we're getting close. Okay, now we're heading back over here. Let's try that one more time. Poof. Okay. That one poofed. Alright, so I need to sleep. And we'll continue this. Okay, let's see here. Now where are we going? Bip, bip, bip. Ah, shoot. Okay, now it's looking like we're right about there. So I need to mark this for, uh, let's see, let's call it check for stronghold. Okay. Very good. I'll uh, we'll see how it goes. And hey, would you look at that? After digging down a little bit, I see brick. Which is a very good sign. Awesome stuff. So, uh, we need to just burrow down into this a little bit more. Yay. How awesome is that? How flippin' awesome is that? Okay, now I get in here but a little bit more. I need to grab let's grab some of these stone bricks. There we go. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, now let's light this place up a little bit. 
definitely. <laughs> you can die. There we go. Cool. Alright, so, uh, let's see, moving right along here, what do we got? A chest with some bread. Good, and some knowledge fragments. I'll keep those there for now. Awesome. And let's see here. Dead end. We're looking at another chest over here with tin and bronze helm. Very good. Awesome stuff here. I'll have to explore that a little bit later. And what I really want in here is not the library, which is nice by the way, but uh, definitely don't want the library. We want something a little bit more hip, 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 you in there, in the door. I said in the door, thank you. No. Bother. Fine. Break the door. All you want... Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to do me some more exploring, so I'll be right back. Okay, we're definitely getting close, because I'm seeing silverfish here. So, yes, very nice. Okay, you can die. Then I know you're gonna call more of your friends, but whatever. Okay. I need to eat. There. Okay. Now. Ow. Stinking silverfish. Woes. Woes. Okay. Ow, ow, ow. 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 Okay. Cool. Okay. Ow. Err. You. Sleep. Crap. Nag. You are creating a big old mess here, too. What the heck? Making it harder for me and you. What in the heck? Okay, you are going to be annoying. You. There. Okay. Now. Um. Bother. Okay, well, there's our portal. Awesome. I need to put something there. Okay, put something there. Hopefully that'll despawn. Hi, bat. How's it going? Hey! Ah! You! Annoying! You! Annoying! Okay, now. Ow! Okay. Cool. Now there's that. Uh, let's see. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Eight. Ender eyes. Okay. So. Eight ender eyes to get to the end. Awesome stuff. I am going to maintain this spawner. Uh, so I can make more silver fish for whatever reason. Uh, very good. Uh, and you know what I'm going to do? I'm gonna just going to forget about these silver fish. Ah, uh, or... Do I want to... That's a good question. Hmm. You know what? I really don't care too much because they don't hurt too bad. Okay, so... And... I grab an ender eye... Here, so I can put it there. Very good. So I just need seven more. Okay. Not too much problem, since we do have villagers for that. Alright, with that, I need to... Place a torch. I said place a torch. Thank you. Kill me some more silverfish. Ouch. Yes. Ouch. Ouch indeed. Very good. And uh, now that I know where that is, which is cool, I can come back whenever I like. Ah. Very good. Hey, now I, I, I see cow. So let's go ahead and grab him up. Hey, come here, cow. Hey, cow. Hey, look what I got. Yes. Okay. Come here, you two. You do, buddy. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, so I'm basically gathering up me some cow, uh, just so that I can continue on with some more of my trading. 
apparently just doing wool and, um, and paper isn't quite working for me, so uh, this cow is going to help me uh, with at least a couple of instances here, one for leather and two for meat. Uh, so yeah, definitely good stuff here. Um, yes, some of the villagers here, they actually trade books for emeralds, mm -hmm. so very much good stuff here. Uh, so come here, yes. Alright, I'll get this set up and be right back. And there's cow. Very good. Yep, just basically gathered up all of the cow that was around here. Very nice. And that should be a nice start for some leather production. Awesome stuff. Alright, uh, another thing that I need to do is actually get some Thongcraft stuff going. Because, yeah, you see, I see a couple, a couple alchemists here. So, yes. Good stuff. I will have to do some stuff with them. Okay, I figure it's about time to go ahead and end the episode here. So, uh, me and my denizens here are going to bid you adieu. And uh, I will see you on the next episode.